Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here. Hi, my name is Emily. I do beauty content here on YouTube. Um, sometimes I do skincare and plus size fashion. But today I have a green makeup look using the Juvia's Rebel Army palette. Uh, it looks like this. And this is how it looks on my eyes. So if you want to see how I did this, it's a quick video. Um, then just please keep on watching. Hi guys, as you saw from the intro, um, today I'm doing a look with the, Juvi the Juvia's Rebel Army palette. It looks like this. And maybe I can match my new nails. I've already primed my eyelids with the P. Louise Cosmetic Base. And now I'm zooming you in a bit. Um, so this palette has two mattes and two shimmers. So I'm basically just going to start out with <clears throat> the darker matte there. And start with that. Um, so yeah, I got this request from a subscriber. Can it be maybe Amy? No. She wanted to see this and the grey and also the wine and only from Colourpop, but that one I've actually used uh, for work once, so I have tested that, so I thought it would be fun to start out with this one. I'm basically starting out like this, and I'm just going to blend. I'm not sure what we should talk about today. In my video with Erika, I said that I was 33 and she said that she couldn't believe it. She said I look to be in my 20s, which is quite fun, <laughs> to be honest, because... Well, it's fun. I'm going to take that one. Um, here in Sweden, when you buy alcohol, we have a special store for alcohol. You can buy it in the grocery store and you have to be 20 to shop there and they check your ID and they still check my ID every time, uh, which is fun for me um, because I look like I look quite young so I always get to show my ID whenever I try to buy some wine. And that actually happens to my sisters too, and my oldest sister is 47. But maybe not now, because she's been, she hasn't been in Sweden for a really long time. But last time when she was in Sweden, she needed to show her ID. <laughs> uh, I also blended out with that shade a bit on top. This is going to be a bit of a messy look because my battery is low. Uh, so much fun to see you comment and engaging a bit on my channel. I will try to be better at uh, responding and see you. So thank you so much for that. My battery managed to, uh, to die. Um, <clears throat> but I was just blending in that other matte shade in my crease. It's a little bit lighter. Uh, I don't know what I was talking about. Yeah, I love that you're more engaging in my channel. Um, hopefully I can start uploading again. I've been enjoying family time during the weekends, but I do miss filming. Um, yes, there's two shimmers because it's a four pan palette. Um, that murky one and that lighter one. I'm going to place that on the outer corners and I'm going to place that on the inner corners or like half half with just a flat brush. So this week I started my new, not my new job, but my new uh, thing I do at work. What do you call it? My new. Oh, I don't know. 
I've gotten some new... I have another role at work, let me just say that. And this week was my first week, and it was also my first week after having those four weeks of vacation. Um, so, yesterday I fell asleep like half past nine, because I was so tired. It's been a lot this week, but it's been fun, so I'm not complaining. I'm assuming you need a little bit extra, I don't know if you can see anything. Then I'm just going to wipe off the brush on my Vermont color switch and take that lighter green, which looks absolutely amazing. And just blend those two together. Green is my absolute favorite shade. Just so you know. Oh well, um, so it has been my first week this week and it was a lot to learn and I'm still not comfortable just being completely on my own but uh, it's fun and that I, I do believe that that helps for the how fast I learn it mm. but yeah how excited are you that fall is coming uh, if it's like today it's sunny and uh, kind of a nice weather, then I, I do like fall. But when it's rainy and... Yeah, when it's rainy I, I don't. But I bought a raincoat. My first raincoat ever. Just to, so that I can go out and play with Matilda, even though it's raining. Yay, yay me. Um, yeah, there is a large flying thing in here that is scaring me. Don't really know where it went. Mm. That lighter green, as you can see, is totally amazing. Uh, I'm going to take that darker green ag again and just blend it a bit. I love Juvis Place Formula, I just don't like the customer service. Um, then I'm taking another fluffy brush and just softening up the edges a bit. My daughter is actually having a bit of a cold and my husband is having a bit of a cold so today we're just staying in. I'm doing some laundry, it's Saturday today. I'm doing some laundry and like doing stuff I didn't have time for in, during the week which is not so fun but when you're an adult <laughs> you have to be have to do stuff that are not fun and I think that I'm happy when it looks like this um, I'm going to clean up my underwrites and then I'm actually going to do my base off cam because I'm not sure how long this battery will last either I'm sorry um, so I'll come back and I we can do the finishing finishing touches and talk a bit about the palette. Now I've done my base obviously and I'm just quickly going to going to talk about what I've used. I used this. This is the Air Cotton Makeup Base in Mint. I need to order another one. It's from the Face Shop. It's almost done. Then I'm actually testing out the Misha Perfect Co Cover BB Cream. It's the second or third time I'm using it and I do like it so far. Uh, I'm using the Tarte Shape Tape. And my bronzer is the Imeme Multi Stick in Bronzer. And just to show you what I have left. This is all I have left. So I've done really good at this with this. Um, I think I've used up more than half actually um, and my goal is to yeah more than half my goal is to get rid of this use it up by the end of this year my blush is the milk makeup lip and cheek in quickie it's this dark dark blush as you can see and then my highlight is the AOA studio perfect pressed highlighter in number no in the shade tiara 
it just looks like this and it looks like that and my brows are the Anastasia brows in Auburn so I'm still happy with how the looks how the eye looks mm. let's zoom in a bit more um, I'm just going to take that fluffier brush and just blend a bit more just to see now that it looks okay with the base and all and it does, I do really like it I'm going to take a um, a this kind of type of brush and I'm going to use the uh, that shade no, I'm going to use the darker shade and, and then blend it out with the lighter shade underneath my eyes I forgot to mention my powder. I'm using the Misha Airpot powder, which is fabulous. Um, I've been really into cream products lately, just because I have some, and I uh, I don't know if you remember it or if you didn't see it, but I had to throw the make makeup bronzer away because it was getting old, and I didn't use that much of it at all, which kind of saddened me. So now I have all of my uh, blushes that are cream or liquid here on front of me and I've been using I've been alternating between them instead of powders this week and I will continue on doing that for a couple of more weeks just so they don't get old before I feel like I have getting used use out of them uh, when you have so many blushes that I do you're bound to have someone go bad on you, but so far I, I'm lucky. I don't have any. I didn't. I don't have. I didn't have to throw anything away because of how old they were. Because some of mostly I have powders. God, I can speak. Uh, but as I said, my liquid or cream blushes need need some more love. I'm basically just blending a bit. Yes, as my inner corner highlight, I want to use a green duochrome, um, so I'm going to fetch that. Um, I went into my drawers, collected the Lotte London Shimmer Squad in Holographic Hall, and there's a green one there called The Gossip. Which looks really good. Yes, this is how it looks. I'm going to spray my face before uh, adding mascara. And I only have the Ofra spray here, but it's quite rough. But I'm going to take that. Um, yes, so... My initial thoughts, and I can definitely vouch for this being my final thoughts. I do really love this palette. Um, this eye makeup look took like 10 minutes to do, really really easy uh, and I do appreciate that. Uh, now I don't wear green to work, I'm not sure why but I'm not comfortable doing that yet. Um, I, I have worn every other shade I think and no one has ever said anything but I'm the most I'm the person who wears the most makeup at my work. Uh, let me tell, me tell you that. Are you the same? I work with both men and women and no one ever wears eyeshadow, it's just me. Uh, anyway, I do really love how this looks. I'm just going to add mascara, the Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. I have another sheen haul coming for you, but almost all of the items I ordered were too big. And I don't, I don't want to show you that, so I'm sending those back and I've ordered some new ones. And But I did keep some of the stuff, so I will probably show you two, two videos. I just need to find the time to film number one. Here is the finished look. I just put on some LH Cosmetics Fantastic in Garnet. 
and uh, just let my hair down. So this is how it looks. Maybe I should zoom you out a bit. Yeah, um, I love this palette. I think it looks good and this was quick and easy. Thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for suggest making a suggest suggest suggestion. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't speak. I think it's because I'm tired. Uh, to make this video, I think it was Amy. Let me see if I can find that so I don't... Maybe she isn't called Amy. Oh well, sorry if you're not called M Amy. It's Scott's. What was it now? Scott's Emmons wife. Okay, anyway, thank you so much for commenting that I should use this. I love this palette. I love green. I love green with my hair color. I love green with my skin tone. So yeah. Uh, again, thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe before you leave if you're not a subscriber. I would love to have you here and until I make another one, you guys, please take care. Bye!